Hey guys, it's Danny Bell. So today we're on day 36 in Everbell, and yeah, let's see what Isabel has to say. <gasps> She's got an announcement. Oh my gosh, guys, we've got a camper. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited, guys. We haven't had a camper in so long. I can't wait to see who it is. I hope it's somebody cool. I really do. We've been in a serious drought when it comes to villagers. We haven't had anybody leave or like even really have um, a chance to go island hopping for a villager. So yeah, I'm really excited. Hope you guys are having an amazing day today. Um, so let's check things out. Um, wanted to just say hello to a couple of villagers and I actually have a surprise lined up for us today. So I'm pretty excited about it. <laughs> Raymond, oh my gosh. What is he wearing? Okay, so FYI, he got this mariachi suit from somebody as a gift on the island from one of the other villagers that I had to deliver and I told him not to wear it and he still keeps wearing it. I swear, it's like his new favorite outfit. <laughs> it's kind of cute though, really. <laughs> Grizzly, what's going on? Oh, I love the little nicknames that the villagers give us. He called us pumpkin. <laughs> All right, so guys, I'm really excited. I actually um, decided that I wanted to try Nookazon for the first time. Um, never done it before. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. I am so pumped. Like, so I put in a couple of um, offers on some mystery bags on Nookazon. For anyone that's never used it before, um, Nookazon is a an app that you can download that is fan base created and it's something where you can actually use it as a platform to um, trade with other players and um, you can actually purchase in-game items for bells. It's just a really cool thing. Um, I've heard a lot of great things about it. Um, FYI, this is I'm not affiliated with them at all. So this is um, no, not a plug or anything like that. Um, I just, I've heard good things about it. So I wanted to give it a try. So I went ahead and put in a couple of offers and um, one of them, at least so far has been accepted. So <laughs> I'm super excited. Um, so for anyone that's not familiar, if you get an offer accepted, um, basically you're gonna get a request for a Dodo code from the seller. Um, I do believe sometimes they do it the opposite way, but this particular seller, has requested our dodo code to come drop off our items and yeah i can't wait i'm super excited so we're gonna go ahead and open the gates and bear with me guys i gotta make sure i send over this dodo code on the nookazon app to make sure that the seller um, can get in and drop our stuff off so um i put a bid on a couple of different ones there was um, some mystery bags i think there was one that had like 20 of them in them um, this one had, I think, 35, which is a ton. So for anyone that is looking for something fun to do, um, these mystery or grab bags are really cool. It's, it's basically like a blind bag. You don't know what you're getting. You could get something really cool. You get, could get something really useless. So it's just kind of a fun thing to do. So yeah, <laughs> I can't wait. I'm really excited. So we've got our gate open. Um, I'm going to wait here a few seconds just to see if they're going to arrive um, but hey, in the meantime, I guess we could go to the campsite, maybe check out who we have at the campsite. I don't know. <laughs> I've never done this, so I'm kind of nervous. Like, I know that we need a drop-off spot, so I'm thinking over here on the beach would be a good place because it's really, like, the main open area that we have on Everbell right now. So, yeah. <laughs> I've got bells in my pockets ready to go um, for the trade, so let's go ahead and drop the bells. That way we're all ready. And I do think the price varies on these. Um, Nookas on the app has sort of like a suggested dollar amount for various items. Um, I went ahead and bid sort of high just because I wanted to make sure we had one go through, at least one, um, for the video today. So, yeah. <laughs> so while we're waiting for our guests to arrive, let's go back by the campsite. I'm kind of excited to see who might be there. Oh, it's CJ! Oh, he's so cute. Look how adorable, guys. <laughs> We better not get involved in a, in a challenge right now because I don't know when this person's going to show up to Everbell. So we better, we better wait on that. <laughs> Guys, check it out. We have a camper. I'm super excited. Who do you think's in there? I'm hopeful it's somebody cool or somebody that goes with our forest core theme. That would be totally amazing. <gasps> oh. Oh my gosh, guys. Okay, so it looks like they're on their way here. Our Nukazan seller is on, our, on their way. I can't wait. I'm so excited. I'm like nervous excited. Oh my gosh, here they come. 
<laughs> I can't believe this. This is crazy. Now we got to run back to the airport because I they're not going to know where to go. I guess I should have waited by the airport. That's my bad. <laughs> All right. So as soon as this unfreezes me, come on, <laughs> my internet. Come on, guys. Let's go. Oh, it's jamming. She's not going to know where to go. All right. There we go. <laughs> I'm just going to hustle on back to the airport so we can make sure that she's got a spot to drop the bags and do the transaction. So let's run back over here. Hopefully, hopefully they're not lost. Oh my gosh, guys, I'm so excited. This is, this is super fun. Oh, there she is. Hi. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Do I emote? Do I talk? I don't know. I feel like these are like some sort of transaction that you would do in an old parking ramp or like a back alley in a busy city. Like it's like here, buy this from the back of my trunk. It'll be it'll it's real, I promise. <laughs> I feel like I'm buying some sort of like <laughs> faux fancy handbag or something out of the back of a trunk. <laughs> oh. Okay, let's go over here. How do I motion to her to follow me? There she comes. Okay. Over here, please. Here's your money. <laughs> Aw, I'm so excited. This is so crazy. Yay! Just so she knows this is hers, I guess this is what I'll do. <laughs> Aw. <laughs> Alright, so I guess, I guess we'll wait for her to drop the bags. Let's see. I'm not really sure what to do. Have you guys used Nukasan before? Is this what you do? Do you just sort of stand there awkwardly while they drop the goods? I don't really know. <laughs> I guess we'll just wait. Oh my gosh, look. Look how cute they are. They're all wrapped up and adorable. Oh my goodness. This is so fun. Should I pick them up now or do I wait? I don't really know, guys. What is um, Nukasan etiquette? Do you start picking up the bags or do you wait patiently? Is it considered rude to pick up the merch before they've taken their money? I certainly am not going to grift her, so I don't want her to think that I'm... Maybe I better wait. Let's just wait. <laughs> wait till she's done dropping all the items and gets the money, and then I'll start picking them back up again. Oh my gosh, look how cute. There's other colored wrapping paper, too. I'm so excited. This is so crazy. So anyways, while she's doing this, um, anyone else that has, uh, is new to Nukazan like I am, um, I don't know, it's, it, it's pretty cool. So basically, once she has dropped everything off and um, leaves, then I, I guess I'm to go back onto Nukazan on the app and rate her, and then she'll rate me, um, and then the transaction's basically done at that point. So it seems pretty easy to follow and understandable, so I'm, yeah, I'm excited. I've got, I've got some, I'm getting some good vibes from this app already, so I'm pretty thrilled. I can't wait to see what we're going to get, guys. I wonder what we're, what we'll get. I guess best case scenario, we'll get a few items that we can use to decorate Everbell with. That would be great. Um, some building supplies would be nice because, you know, there's always that. <laughs> So for anyone that um, is newer that is looking to try it out, um, I believe that you can trade for bells. You can also trade. Some people will ask for Nook Miles tickets um, for trade for items. Some people have wish lists where they will be looking for very specific items from the game um, to basically barter for transactions. So yeah, it's pretty versatile. So far, I'm pretty impressed. Wow, that's a lot of grab bags, guys. I think there's supposed to be 35. Let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 18, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 20, 22, 23, 24, 25. Just... Looks like they're all there. Okay. Wow. I'm super excited. I guess I'll pick some of them up. Does she know to take the money? Maybe I should tell her. Let me get in the chat and see if I can type. Yep. That's your money. I th Is she waiting for me? <laughs> Is she waiting for me to say something? I don't really know what the etiquette is. I'm so new to this. Oh, forgive me. I'm I'm new. <laughs> I'm a noob. <laughs> yep, the money's yours. Go ahead and take it. I'm I'm guess I'm just gonna keep picking these up. Oh, there she goes. Okay, she sees. Yep, that's for you. <laughs> Do I show her out to the airport? I hope she doesn't get lost. Maybe I should walk her back. <laughs> I don't really know 
what to do. Oh, maybe she's confused. I put an extra bag of, of bells there for her as a tip. You guys, um, it's not required, but it does say on certain profiles that people appreciate tips. So I did add a little bit of extra. Okay, so she must be wondering why there's more there than what um, the agreed upon amount was. Let me just type to her real quick here. I'm so slow at typing, guys. Sorry. <laughs> I do love using the typing app though. It's really great. It makes it a lot easier to use the Nintendo app to type. <laughs> As we both stand here awkwardly. <laughs> Maybe she's just wondering. I guess I should probably tell her that yeah, that there's extra. That way she's not confused. So she knows it's for her. <laughs> oh she's excited okay that's pretty easy okay so I guess that's it I guess she just maybe I should see her out so that she doesn't get lost <laughs> oh so awkward <laughs> that would be really hard I guess to navigate through people's islands if you've never been there over here <laughs> oh look at grizzly being a bodyguard for us guys he's like our bouncer <laughs> never mind the scary bear waiting at the airport there for you thank you so much <laughs> don't mind him he's a lot scarier looking than he actually is ah <laughs> so sweet i would say this has been a pr pretty good first experience so far guys there we go she's she found the airport okay <laughs> all right let's go back over here by our bags I think she made it in. Make sure Grizzly didn't get to her. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> All right, let's go back over here. She'll probably be flying out here in a second. It might interrupt us, so that's okay though. I'm gonna start picking up our goodie bags and yeah, then we can start tearing into them. I'm really excited. Look how many we have, guys. I'm super thrilled. Like this was just one drop off and I have another bid in for another one. So we're going to have a lot and maybe we'll just get to these ones today. But yeah, I'm super excited. There she goes. <laughs> and I guess it's really important to make sure we rate. So I need to go in um, temporarily and make sure I rate, rate her. And I'm definitely giving her five stars. She was very sweet, very prompt. <laughs> Great service. I'm super excited. Yay! Okay. All right, as soon as this cutscene goes through, then we will go ahead and get to our bags. Look how many. Look how pretty they are, too, guys. All right, I guess I'm not very prepared. I should have emptied my pockets. I went shopping at Nook's Cranny earlier, um, so I probably ought to drop the things that I bought from Nook's Cranny just to get it out of my pockets so that we have enough space for all of our goodie bags. I think I've got a shopping addiction, guys, and I think Nikazan is going to be like a bad influence on me. <laughs> All right, we'll get some of these tools out of here. I think this should hopefully be enough room. Let's drop one more, and then we need to ditch some of these other things, too. That way we're not constantly having to, like, pick up. I should have put this stuff away <laughs> for us ahead of time. There we go. Okay. Get this flower out of here. I don't know where I picked up these weeds. Let's get these out of here. And we got this wallpaper we bought from the cranny earlier. So let's get rid of that. Okay. Now let's pick up our bags. <laughs> I'm going to organize them, I guess, by color. I don't know if there's rhyme or reason to the color. Like, is it color coded? Is that a thing? Or is it just random? We'll keep them all together just in case. This is so fun, guys. This is like super Christmas, right? It feels like toy day all over again. <laughs> All right, let's pick up our items and then we'll rearrange them and then we'll get to opening. I can't wait to see what we got. So for any of you guys that have tried Nookazon and you've done these uh, mystery bags or grab bags, what did you think of it? Was it something that you felt was worthwhile? Was it worth the bells? Was it worth the time? Let me know. I'd love to hear about your experiences in the comments um, just because I'm sort of a noob at this. Um, yeah, let me know what you thought of Nookazon and what your experience was. What was the best and worst item that you got um, getting grab bags. I'd love to find out. So let me know in the comments. <laughs>
All right, let's see. We're going to start opening. Let's start with these blue ones. Ooh, guys, we got a partition. That's a good one. I wonder what color it is. Let's see. Ooh, a red imperial partition. That's useful. Well, so far, so good, right? Crescent moon chair. Ooh, oh my gosh, so far this is great. I'm sure we'll get some duds along the way, but I'd say these are two really solid items to start out with. I love that crescent moon chair too. We might have to use that in a build someplace on the island. So cute. And I love them because they glow in the dark at night too. <gasps> a kitty litter box. <laughs> Well, I guess we know who that's going to go to, right? I've got just the villager to give this to. <laughs> it's perfect. Oh my gosh, it screams Raymond, right? <laughs> we'll definitely have to be giving that to Raymond or setting it up by his house somewhere later. Ooh, fireplace. That's a really solid item too. Nice. A vanity. Okay. Nice. That's a pretty good color, too. I think I already have this one cataloged, but that's still pretty cool. I love how you can turn the fireplace on and off. <laughs> the fireplaces are such great items to use vers versatility, too. Like, you can use them for, like, little countertops, for restaurants, all kinds of stuff. <gasps> what is this? The throwback mitt chair? That's kind of cute. I mean, it totally does not go with our aesthetic, but I bet we could gift that to um, a villager. If I wasn't trying to push Goose out the door, that would be the perfect gift for him because he's a jock. Okay. Oh, we got some wallpaper. Green blossom walling. Okay, so this must be color-coded because I noticed the blue ones were all big furniture items. And then these seem to be like flooring and wallpaper. That's pretty thoughtful that they color-coded all these presents. That's really nice. Ooh, okay, that yellow flooring is going to be great. That's the wooden flooring with the little white flowers on it. That's going to be great. We can probably really use that. I'm just going to drop these on the ground here. Sh like, ooh, a ship deck paper too. We'll sort of have to sort these out later, but... Let's see. Okay, let's see. Let's open the gold ones now. Wait, what? Tree branches. <laughs> I mean, I guess it did say there might be crafting items, so I'm not going to be too disappointed. We can make some stuff with the tree branches. We got some customization kits. Conches. Okay, some shells. So these must be the crafting items. Ooh, pine cones. That's a great crafting item. Those are out of season right now, so that's really useful. We can use that to make a lot of the tree's bounty items. <gasps> All right. Ooh, we got five gold nuggets, too. That's a nice item. I feel like that practically paid for the entire lot itself. That's really nice. I guess I feel good that I paid extra for these things too now that I see that there's gold nuggets in there. What's in here? Okay, let's see. Ooh, sandals. Those are going to be adorable. A dress. These must be clothing items. Ooh, a tunic. Oh, that's cute. I think that's that little button-down tunic. I wonder what color it is. <gasps> Ooh, a mom's sweater. I love those. I know some people really dislike the mom's items, but I love them. I think they're so cute. It reminds me of like the ironic 80s dressing that goes on a lot, like the mom jeans. Like, give me a mom sweater and a pair of mom jeans and I'm good to go, guys. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got. Um, oh, look at these little sunglasses too. Those are cute. A sweater. That'll be handy in a couple of months. Oh, it's cute, too. Look, it's got a little teddy bear face on it. That's a cute one. I don't know if I've ever seen that one before. <gasps> that is so cute. Oh, my gosh. I'm so excited. Yay. All right, let's see what color this tunic is. Ooh, it's like a mint green. That's a cute color. I don't think we have that color cataloged yet, either. Perfect. So far, this is great. This is totally worthwhile. Oh, that's cute. Look at that little wrap dress. That's cute. All right, let's see what else we got. I think we got sandals too. Where can I put these sandals down? I want to see what they look like. I love the gladiator sandals. 
Oh, so cute. Look, they're like the tan color. Those are so cute. They're going to go with everything. I'm super excited. All right, let's see what some pink ones. <gasps> Pitfall seeds. Oh, that's fun. I love those. We'll have to try those out. Cardboard box. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, tickets. That's okay. We can use that to buy some rugs next time she shows up. Hamster cage. <gasps> oh, a timer. That's cute. Is it like a little pocket watch? Let's put the hamster cage down first. Get some of these things set out. Oh my gosh, guys. Stop it right now. Look how cute. It's running on the wheel. That cracks me up. <laughs> Has anybody ever like given a hamster to their hamster villagers? Just curious. Let me know. Let me know. <laughs> In a grand twist of irony. <laughs> All right, let's see. Pitfall seeds. Look at the little timer. It's so cute. <gasps> you can set the time. Shut up. We have to try this out, right? <gasps> oh my gosh. Okay, let me get a tool out. Pause for a second. Let's try this. We've got a net. Okay, let's see if we can catch a bug. Oh, <laughs> come here, butterfly. I want to see what happens. Let's catch it. Come here. Oh my gosh, I'm so bad. The depth perception in this with the net. I can't. <laughs> we got it oh oh look at guys check it out at the top where the timer is it counts the bugs <gasps> look now we got two bugs oh my gosh that's so cool look at it it keeps track of the fish and the um sea creatures too well now we got to try to catch a fish let me get the fishing rod out what's this creepy thing what is this Oh, Lord, I hope it's not a snake. I hate snakes, guys. I'm, like, terrified of snakes. IRL. Like, hate them. Oh, my gosh. What is it? It feels really big. Ew. Oh, my gosh. It is. It's an eel. Okay, ew. That's pretty much like a snake. I mean, it's from the water. It's, like, that's not right. Anything that doesn't have arms and legs shouldn't be able to move that fast. It's so gross. <laughs> Let's just put it down here. Oh my gosh, ew. I mean, I guess it's one for the Critterpedia, right? <laughs> All right, well, that's pretty cool. We had some fun with the timer. Um, now that we're familiar with how that works, that's kind of cool. I like that. That's a cool item to give away in a, in a grab bag. All right, let's stop the timer and we can drop that and keep opening our goodies. I can't wait to see what else we got. This has been really great so far. Hey, let's see what else we've got. We still have some more items to open. So these are the last round of colors. I'm not sure what's in here. <gasps> Ooh, okay. These must just be like the randomized items. Let's see. Ooh, an upright vacuum. A toilet cleaning set. Because <laughs> who doesn't need that, right? And a book. Okay, let's see what these are first before we open up the rest of them. An oil barrel. Let's see what color. <gasps> Ooh, it's the rusty one. We can probably use that on Everball to decorate with. I do love the oil barrels. They're super useful. A garbage bin. <laughs> That's perfect. <laughs> I actually like that color of garbage bin. I think we got the brown one, so that's pretty cool. That's a different color. A little orange vacuum cleaner. Let's see what else. Our toilet cleaning set, of course. We can put that in our bathroom. That's going to be necessary. In a book cute all right we got five more a rotary phone a scenic oh a scenic painting stop right now we have to put this down <gasps> guys this is like the best thing ever because since we have not upgraded the museum we won't get to see red so that means no artwork so this is exciting, guys, because this is the very first piece of art that Everbell has seen. Like, this is dope. I don't know if this is real or fake, but I honestly don't care because I'm not donating it to Blazer Blathers. Like, we can use this to decorate our house, and I'm really, really excited. Oh my gosh, super score with the artwork. I'm so excited. That's awesome. What a great gift. All right, we got a rotary phone. That's cute. I love it. Baby panda. <laughs> oh, a mom's pen stand. I love the mom's items. Like, that's cool. We got a couple of those. Okay, let's see. We got a baby panda. Let's see what color it is. Oh, cute. Okay, that's cool. 
We could probably gift that to one of the bear villagers or, the, or Marty, maybe. Mom's pen stand. Nice. Oh, what's this other thing? Let me see if I can find space to put this last item down here. Soft serve lamp. Ooh, that's a good one. Look how cute the little ice cream. Oh, it's like a vanilla ice cream cone. I love that you can turn it on and off too. That's going to be really cute to decorate with too. We'll have to find a spot for that as well. Guys, I would say this is like a super awesome haul of stuff. All right, pause for a second. Goose is here. We are going to use our shovel and let's try out one of the, um, let's try out one of the pitfall seeds. Wait for it. Wait for it. While well, he's unsus unsuspectedly doing his little workout. Let's see. Come on, buddy. All you got to do is step backwards. <laughs> there, we, there we go. Finally. <laughs> that took a hot five minutes. Yay, Goose. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, my gosh, guys. I made him mad. He's, like, really angry. Guys, what do I do? He's coming after me. Oh, no. I've, I've angered him. Bye. <laughs> Maybe he'll be angry enough to ask to leave. I don't know if that does anything. <laughs> Poor Goose. Poor Goose. I've made him so angry. I feel kind of bad. <laughs> Hopefully he'll forgive us. If not, maybe he'll ask to leave, if anything. Well, guys, check this out. I think we got a lot of really great items from this. Um, I'm really excited about this Nookazan grab bag batch that we got. I think it was totally worthwhile. I'm sure that probably not all of them are this, um, like, filled with, like, lots of useful goodies. I'm sure there's some that maybe aren't quite as packed full of good stuff. But I'd say we won, we won the jackpot this time around. I, I feel like I will definitely probably try Nookazan again and do more of these mystery bags. Well, Goose, Goose seems to have cooled off a little bit, so that's good. I'm sorry, Goose. Will you forgive me? Oh, now I feel bad. Oh, back to his workout. I guess it didn't phase him. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay, let's take this kitty litter box, and we need to give it to Raymond. Actually, on second thought, maybe we'll just put it down here. Maybe we'll just set it outside his house. What do you think? Let's put it here for now. It's perfect. It's right by his little writing nook, right? Okay, let's sit it down and see how it looks. Love it. Oh my gosh. It's perfect. <laughs> oh, Raymond. Only the best kitty amenities for you, my dear Raymond. <laughs> okay, so before we finish up today, um, I know we didn't do anything like build-wise today, but we need to see um, what camper we have. We got interrupted, so let's go in. I wonder who's in there, guys. Let's go check it out before we wrap up for the day. Oh, I'm so nervous. I always get that sick feeling before I go in. Who do you think it's going to be? I hope it's somebody really cute. Maybe it'll be someone pink. <gasps> it's Cherry. Oh, my gosh, guys. She is so cute. Look how cool she is. Oh, my gosh. Look at her little pierced ears. Dude, that's so cool. Oh my gosh, Cherry. I didn't expect to see you here. <gasps> I think we need to ask her to see. Like, she doesn't technically go with the forest core theme, but I feel like it's worth a shot to see if maybe if we can um, win a game with her or something. Maybe she'll ask Goose to leave. Um, I feel like I've tried for a long time to sort of get him to the lowest level of friendship, like compared to the other villagers, but I don't know. Sometimes it's totally random. But I feel like it's probably worth it. Like, let's just see if we can um, get to the point where she'll play a game or ask to move here. And then we'll see if she'll replace Goose because I think that would be great. And I know ultimately I really would like to do some more island hopping at least one more time um, before we finish up out Everbell and release the dream address. Um, but let's just see. We'll give it a shot. Maybe it'll be worth it if she asks Goose to go. is not working all right she doesn't want to move here um let's try again we're just gonna keep talking to her she hurt my feelings guys let's see oh maybe she'll okay this is so confusing come on cherry don't make me ask a hundred times don't make me grovel 
Oh man, we are just stuck in this dialogue. I might have to like go and go out and come back in. Sometimes that works. Oh, Cherry. Okay, why why not join us? <gasps> no. <laughs> why is this not working? All right, guys, one more time. We're going to ask. I just want to try to see if she'll replace Goose. Persistence is the key in this. I feel like sometimes you really got to like legit talk to them about 50 times before they will ask or like talk to resident services to come move here. I just want to see if we can get get her um, to move. FYI, I had to cut some of that out, guys. It was ridiculous. I failed and failed and failed <laughs> playing games with her. And finally, she's going to ask um, Tom Nook. So that was like forever. Let's see. Please be Goose. Please be Goose. Please be Goose. <gasps> Okay, let's see. Do it. Do it. Do it. No. <laughs> no, not Fauna. Oh, Cherry, you're so cute. But I don't want to get rid of Fauna. I love Fauna. She's perfect for Everbell, and I just can't do it. I'm so sorry. Oh, Cherry, I'm sorry. No. <laughs> That's sad. I'm really sad about that. I She's really cute, guys. Um, But I just can't do it. I can't. I can't swap out Cherry for Fauna. I just can't do it. It makes me sad. Bye, Cherry. Maybe in another island. <laughs> Maybe in another lifetime or island you can come live here. <laughs> oh. Well, guys, I hate to say it, but Cherry will have to just be a camper. Um, but hey, we had a really great day today. I really enjoyed trying out Nookazan with you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm really looking forward to doing a few more builds on Everbell and looking forward to building things up so we can finally release the dream address in the future. Wishing you guys an amazing day. Take care and we'll see you in the next one.